Hey guys, Coach Katie here with Coach Josh. We're gonna show you this week's density set workout. So we will have six stations, two exercises at each station. You're gonna be at each station for 90 seconds. We're gonna go through the room two times. Are you ready, Josh? Yes. Okay. Station number one on the ropes, you're gonna get 10 strong rope slams in. So standing on the black floor. Notice that Josh is using his hips, sitting his butt back as he slams, taking his time with those 10 as hard as he can. And you're gonna step forward, you're gonna get one of our balls, we're gonna do that ball chest pass. You're gonna step into it and really throw it out from your chest. It'll take a lot of power straight out from your chest, slamming the ball on the wall. Now Josh is catching the ball. You wanna let it drop and then pick it back up. You can do that, it's just gonna be five and make sure you're stepping into that ball chest pass. Five ball ball chest passes and then 10 ropes in. Station number two is on the TRX and we will start with our TRX reverse fly. So plank position, soften the elbows, opening those arms out to the side, really squeezing those upper back muscles here. So if Josh had a pencil, it would be squeezed right there in that upper back between those shoulder blades. Nice and controlled as you lower back down. Stepping in as far as you can, making sure you're not using your hips to open up. If you do that, it's too heavy, you just need to step out. We're gonna do five. Then you're gonna stand up straight, and you're gonna do five jump squats. So really exploding out of that jump squat here, okay? Using the trainers to push yourself up, get a little bit more height. If you need to take the jump out, just do five squats with or without the trainers, and then you're back to those reverse slides. Station number three is on the floor. We'll have all the sleds out. You're gonna squat row that sled down. So stepping away from the sled, arms straight out in front of you. Sit your butt back, but notice how Josh is letting his butt go below his knees. Then you're gonna drive up with the legs, pull with the arms. Again, step back, make sure your arms are out in front of you. Sit back, drive up with your legs, and pull with those arms at the same time. You're gonna go all the way down the front floor. When you get all the way down, just put those TRX around your wrist, grab those beams on the sled, and you're gonna drive it back. Big steps, driving with those legs all the way back down, and you should have time to go again. You're gonna leave the sleds wherever they're at when the timer's called. Station number four, we're gonna need a kettlebell out, so go ahead and get yourself heavy on there, Joshua. And we're gonna do, yeah, heavy. Heavy, heavy one. We're gonna do five goblet squats. So we'll have all of the kettlebells out, holding that kettlebell at your chest. Deep breath in on the way down. Blow that air out as you drive up out of that squat. Squeeze those glutes tight at the top. Five of those goblet squats. Then put your kettlebell side down to the floor, plank position, five push-ups. So take your time with your push-ups, you guys. Make sure your chest is getting low like Josh is showing here. If you need to, go down from your toes, lower your knees, Push up from your knees and then back to the toes, down, push up from your knees. Or if the one from your knees is the one that your chest gets low to the ground, that's the one you're working on right now, which is great. You're gonna do five and then you're back to the goblet squat. Station number five. I don't know if we've ever done this one, you guys. So, we're gonna do rower and skier. 10 of each. You're gonna wanna take your time and focus on pulling strong here. Notice how Josh is putting his feet in the foot straps and then tightening those so that he's nice and secure. Then he doesn't have to worry about falling out of it because he's pulling strong 10 times. He's taking his time, pulling as hard as he can, leaning back as he pulls, deep breath in, blow that air out. Get your 10 strong strokes in on the rower. Unstrap your feet, hop on out. Grab a skier and get 10 strong strokes on the skier. So reach high, sit that butt back, deep breath at the top, blow that air out as you're pulling your toes, sit back and pull strong again. 10 strokes there and then you go back to the rower. So it's 10 and 10 here. Last station here, you're gonna get a set of dumbbells. We're gonna start with our pivot press. So dumbbells at the shoulders, pivoting on the foot, driving that same arm up. So pivoting this way, driving up with the left, Facing that way, driving up. So the pivot really uses that hip motion to press that arm up. You can do five and five, you can alternate or get five on one, five on the other. Then just take those dumbbells down in front of you and you're gonna do RDLs here, so Romanian deadlift. Notice how Josh has a nice flat back. His legs, his knees are bending only slightly so he's feeling a nice pull in the hamstrings and then driving up, still squeezing those glutes to the top. 
So keeping a big proud chest here, arch lower back, driving up, squeezing those glutes. You're gonna feel some pulling in the hamstrings. That's just those stretching out. So it's hamstring glute dominant exercise there so you're not going as low with the regular deadlift. All right, two rounds. Nice job, Josh. 